Hello everyone. Welcome to the gardens here in the Findhorn Foundation. I'm reading today a message from Dorothy McLean's book, Seeds of Inspiration. And uh, in this series, I'm kind of gradually working my way through the various plants that are here in the garden that were part of what Dorothy would have attuned to when these messages were coming in. The message today is one from the Deva of Lupins, which are, you can see behind me, they come in a variety of colors and they're always very showy and delightful. We come to be, the pattern is there, out of seeming nothingness we appear, fulfilling the symmetry of the inner map of our being. Nothing else matters. We have a fixed idea to which we stick and bring into manifestation. We bring that inner essence out. That is why we are here. Yet we do all this in pure harmony with others. We hold our own note firmly among the other notes which make up the whole. Unlike humans, to get our defined way, we tread on no one else. There is room for all. We and others have been made for our work. No one can interfere with us, and we would interfere with no one else. With something to do for our Creator, we are free in the midst of all freedom. You say how wonderful it is to have a clear mi mission with nothing to deflect one. Yes, of course it is. There is nothing else. We admit we do not understand the human wastage of energy in directions later regretted, which is impossible to us. Our pattern is here and there is no other direction for energy to flow into. You ask, do you not want to frolic? But we do. In the flow of our energy, in our living, we frolic far more than humans do. Our movements are joyous and everything in our nature has scope in our worlds. Rebel, we are completely satisfied and fulfilled in life, so rebellion is not of us. From birth to death in the outer plants, from age to age in time, or in ever-changing eternity, there is a full and fulfilling life. All is catered for and nothing is left to chance. Any lacks in the outer are not of our concern. We are what we are regardless. We wish we could share more fully the great happy divine life which is, which is all there is. Think of that when you see us in all our ordered and varied color. Remember and join in our freedom of being. Until the next time, bye for now.